These are the only fashion trends you actually need to know about. What I mean by this is that these are the fashion trends that will actually revitalize and refresh your old, outdated outfits while simultaneously being actually useful in your wardrobe. I know. So there you have it. Let's start. Hello everyone, I'm Kaylina. If you're just stumbling upon this, I do fashion and lifestyle and advice videos and vlogs. Yeah, that's what I do. So if that sounds of interest to you, then you can uh, watch more of my content after this video. But also, I have a degree in fashion, Ooh. but I do have experience in the fashion industry and a degree, and I have been very successful in my trend forecasting. I've never been wrong yet. I'm not saying it can't happen, because it can, but it hasn't happened to me yet. So first one is quiet dressing. Now don't get me wrong, you can still wear your louder, crazy, wild child pieces, but may I just suggest sprinkling it in a little, because mm, with the world today, as they say, it seems that we are going more for a very timeless classic look. Classic, timeless actually useful, sustainable. I like the sustainable part. Okay, so what I mean by this, clean, timeless, soft, neutrals, beige, dressing and pairings. So like a head to toe classic look, classic pieces like vest, blazers, a well cut jean, a crisp white shirt, classic logo free sweatshirt, loafers, a well tailored but still loose fit trouser. Yeah, and your classic knits and cashmeres classic timeless pieces that never really fade from fashion. So the trick to go from a kind of mundane, boring style of this to a more elevated and modern one is to incorporate modern touches. So let's say head to toe you are in the traditional classic pieces, but each piece is actually modernized to today. So the denim is a loose fit, which is in style today. The classic black sunglasses have a particular shape that is more trend for today, even though they're still a classic black frame. The loafers are the latest one from Celine. The earrings are more modern. Like, yes, they're a classic little gold hoop, but they're modernized. They're on more of a trend for today. Do you see what I'm saying? So that's how you elevate this and it doesn't feel so boring and like you're wearing your mom's clothes even though most of our moms grew up in the 90s and that's the best style ever so i'm personally happy to repeat my mom's style i don't know about you and i'm not talking quiet luxury here retire the quiet luxury thing it's not even accurate it's not even accurate because quiet luxury is not quiet we all know that bag is from the rub but another topic for another day <laughs> that's not what this is this is classic timeless dressing doesn't matter if i see a logo or not the piece in itself is a classic timeless concept I really couldn't care less if you have a logo or not. It's like, just, can we just move on from this? This is not even special anymore. Anyway, second, keeping to our classic style is the long tailored black coat. I've been telling you this for two years. I have the receipts. I'll put them here. I'll give it a second. Long tailored coats are the thing to go for. That is a coat that is hitting at your ankle or just above your ankle. It's long, long sleeves, elongated style. It can be more structured if you want or it can be a looser fit. They both go for now and they're modern. This is a coat you will have for years and years and years. It serves you so well. I know mine does. I have mine, I'll link it below. I really love it and it's still on sale today. The theme on the runway was black and on the runway or not, Black is timeless, it's a perfect piece to have, and you can say you're on trend. Third is the white shirt. Again, keeping to our classic theme, but this is, I called it white shirts galore, because it's everywhere. Yes, this is a wardrobe capsule, we all know the benefits of having a white shirt, but these white shirts in particular actually can incorporate your own little character, charm, your own little flair to them, because they're all quite unique. You have more options to subtly express yourself through this otherwise classic and repetitive in nature piece. So think like a long gown-like style that you wear to brunch with your friends. Hot date or evening out for drinks. You can do a silk one with elongated sleeve that goes past the wrists, maybe a bigger cuff, and pair it with a mini skirt. Cute. 
elevated style to work with one with a more angular styled collar. I saw a lot of unique collars on the runway of this shirt. And you can pair that with your work appropriate midi skirt. And like I said, I personally like this because I can add this in a way that speaks to my style. I'm not just stuck with the classic basic one. I can have fun, you know? I personally really like the silk one with the long sleeves style. That's something I definitely have on my list to get. It all works and I love it. Moving on. Fourth is what I'm calling the scarf coat. So this is perfect for fall to take place from your coats and it's also perfect for a fall to winter transition to pair with your coats or even a blazer or tweed jacket. It's a good way to surpass the winter coat as long as you want to. I mean, I love winter coats, but you know what I mean. So blanket scarf dressing. I'm seeing this belted, swathed over the shoulder, pinned with a pin. You can style it in tonal dressing. I saw a ton of that and I personally really love it, but you can still also do it in a really fun color print, checked print, floral print, stripes. I saw that too. And I think it goes without saying that the blanket scarf is obviously a good trend to invest in because you can take it out year after year after year. These scarves, I would go as bold as saying they don't really go out of style or they won't be going out of style anytime soon because they serve a functional purpose. They keep you really warm and if it works, why break it? So yeah. And what I like about the shoulder draping version of this is it always gives that really elegant, sophisticated, classy look. I, mean, I just, if I see a woman like that, I'm like, oh, she's elegant. <laughs> okay, for my more fun one, okay. The metallics. So a more draped liquid lame dress. And I'm not saying this because I think that this is timeless in the sense of that you will be able to repeat it year after year after year, but it is a piece that if you invest in a good one, you can keep in your wardrobe. And I wanna do a video on this. You can keep it in your wardrobe, even for when it goes out of style, hang on to it, bring it back out again when it's back in style, because this is a style that comes and goes quite often. Bringing something like this out once in a while, and I'm speaking about an elongated maxi dress version of this, something that's cut in a more classic, timeless way. You can always bring it out here and there. So while it's in style and on trend right now, take advantage of it because it's fun why not if you can uh, but also know that is something that if you invest in a high quality one that you can keep it and pass it on to your daughter one day things like that okay that's it you guys this was short and sweet because fashion trends should be short and sweet i'm just kidding i love trends personally i love to play with trends i am not anti-trend but I know that the talk of fashion trends and what's in and what's out can be really overwhelming. We can simplify and just sprinkle in little doses here and there that actually suit our style and not care about the rest. <laughs> like I said, again, I like fashion trends. I like playing with my style. I like refreshing it here and there, but there's nothing like fashion trends that you can actually keep and transition from season to season here and there and bring back out the following year. And so what I really loved about this fall winter runway season was that a lot of the designers were purposely going for something that is more classic and timeless. So there you go, there you have it. Give the video a like because I know you enjoyed it. I would love to know what trends you are really into right now. What from this list will you be wearing? Or are you already wearing it because it's end of August? I really would love to know, so don't forget to tell me in the comments because I read all your comments and I love you guys and I love hanging out with you and talking to you. And that's it, I could talk to you all day, but I will love you and leave you here mostly because I have a Pilates class that I have to get to. So I will see you in the next video. I personally love that all my neighbors typically see me in a more quiet, subdued style all week long, and then suddenly my style's like pow and all blah blah boom on a Wednesday coming back from the grocery store. It's like my favorite hobby.